So then we are back with the modern understandings from the time of the second tabernacle services where we find in the Aramaic English translation of the word. This translation comes from the original manuscripts of the prophets of the Tzayelic lineage. So then we can understand the time of the end. Periyar Shiahu the prophet. Then those who take the time to study the Holy Scripture and enjoy studying the Scripture. And the great multi-facet of Elohim as stated then during the time of creation then we can understand those who are then enlightened as then per the angel when he spoke with Daniel while during his rest so then every time there is a great understanding of the scripture a person must understand tabernacling and where it comes from However, the Messiah then provided also many other understandings such as those people not believing his words. And then in Luke, very important pointing it out because what we so then regarded as familiar ended up being very alien. So what has he stated regarding then tabernacling. So then, let's try to find out those who are then enlightened and those who are not. As we understand, Deuteronomy 11 speaks of Mount Gerizim and Mount Ebel where then favors were then upon a mountain and then the curses upon the other mountain. Interestingly then the Messiah when he came out of Jerusalem he came out as then tabernacling and he went to Mount Gerizim because he was then a hundred percent favor and favored with the Creator. So then, when the Messiah explains many areas of Luke, then we find sections of it where then the Messiah explains what would be then the end. These understandings, however, they must relate with the time of the end because then layer upon layer of understanding. The Messiah never mentioned regarding himself outside of the Holy of Holies. So then, in Luke 1 7 we find then, for they were eating and drinking and taking wives and giving them to husbands until the day that Noah entered into the ark and then came at the Vesuvius and destroyed them. He's not speaking of evil. You know, the normal mundane situations. You know, but people are always trying to find a way out of it other than tabernacling. That's why then, the scripture is then stupidity when those who do not study then they perish. Because we do understand there is a false scripture. How do we know this? Second Corinthians 11.4 A whole segment of a scripture was concocted during the time of the thousand years of deceit. But how then could people be deceived so bluntly without understanding the proper scripture? Well, the Messiah already gave the answer. For they were eating and drinking and taking wives and giving them to husbands until the day that Noah entered the ark and the Vesuvius came and then destroyed them. What is the Luke 1 7 then layered with? Metichiahu, the 24th chapter. Because he's speaking of the time of the end. Luke was a Gentile. But the set apart were in charge then of the oracles. And those were delegated responsibilities. So then Luke was a Gentile. Yet he recorded what the Messiah had said regarding then the layer of understanding of Mitchiah, the 24th chapter. But then Shaliach Shaul said at the end of times people would have a, such a mind as seared as with a hot iron. You know, the deceit is so big around the world and they believe a scripture that is so embedded in them 
And they don't understand the holy instructions. They don't understand, they don't grasp yet the idea there is not a Messiah outside of the Holy of Holies. And again, as it was in the days of Lot, that they were eating and drinking and buying and having trade and planting and building. So the Messiah is speaking the normal situations of life, is he not? But then those are the cares of life. These people are going to be caught and destroyed because they care for their lives. They want to believe a Messiah outside of the Holy of Holies. They want to be part of this condemned world because they are condemned themselves. That's why the Messiah said the end the cares of life and then this he was explaining the word as tabernacling tries to enter the person but then because of the cares of life then they turn their backs on tabernacling and go into the world believing that the world at the end is going to be saved and when it's not going to be saved because the world is condemned precisely what the Messiah is explaining and again, it's one of the days of Lot, that they were eating, they were drinking, they were buying, they were having trade and planting and really they were building. The normal main day, the cares of life. So then, evaluating from the viewpoint of the Messiah, what else has he said? But on the day that Lot then went out of Sodom, then the Creator rained down fire and brimstone from heaven and destroyed them. So then, what is in America these days? What kind of a religion blinds the people so badly? Because we are not speaking of a person being perfect or not. We are speaking of a Messiah explaining His holy instructions. If you place your trust in somebody else other than the Messiah for who he is, tabernacling, then you are always going to mock and point your finger and you are never going to be satisfied. Because the demons in you do not let you. That's why then Shaliak Shaul in Romans 7 Explained, there is a conflict that goes on in a person when tabernacling then becomes evident. It doesn't mean you're going to be perfect. But what the Messiah has said, the Messiah said at the end of times, then people would be caught unaware. Precisely what is coming through these days because there is a system coming from the East where this neutral system is going to be from nation to nation as then described. Gala 1.8 explains. It's not what we understand these days. The Babylonian system yet is not of what we understand today. And then we find the great realm of New Zealand already going through a lot of changes of their economy. So then, since the scripture is very clear as far as a system is concerned, what would be then the normal factor of a country establishing then parameters so they can begin taxing those financial institutions? As we understand, it's for the third time there is a leakage of information in the New Zealand realm. Came out the third time, information, personal information of homeowners. So how a nation then starts then designing the subsystem and then creating a situation where then they are going to monitor the funding or transfer of funding. Because when the Chinese system comes, you download your computer and you start instantly then investing. But then the system, the circuitry is closed. 
the government can go in there and verify what you have other than how much you transfer so then it's for the third time over there in the realm of New Zealand and then they are experiencing these leakages can't you observe then the government already working from behind because they have to start some place in order for them not to fight in court for the privacy acts of those financial institutions where in the future are going to be doing your transfers they have to start with an area where they're not only banking in personal information but not relevant information also mixed up to begin to understand why then the situations are taking place why then the subsystem must be redesigned so when the system comes then they are always in the positive however the privacy rights then would be removed because they can monitor their 10 percent as far as our government is concerned the USA we are bankrupt we don't even understand the basics what was so trivial in the past as far as understanding then production understanding then expenses in balancing the economy we don't have an even a set standards of balancing the economy but we always believe there is a savior out there you know wandering around the world where then someday because people have done so much of their own standards then they would be granted then a place in heaven where they are not going to heaven heavens coming to the earth does it not state then the prophecy of Ezekiel then a relation with it and he saw the new Jerusalem the capital of the new world so then is that then the creator going to give you the understanding of he's coming down and people are going up or evaluating then people would be resting the souls would be resting until the time comes So then the Messiah gave the answer regarding then Revelation 1 8, where then the freighters of the earth would be in charge. Governments are going to be secondary. When the system becomes available the next day, you can't believe it, the next day, people won't have any more savings in their banks. That's why nations they are already going through their backlogs making sure they are up to date because the system is active and up to date daily so as the Chinese produces companies they produce and they are socialists but they maintain a military style of production as we used to be in the past and we are not taxing as we should have people can rationalize as much as they want whatsoever then the Creator has spoken through his prophets is coming through and then Daniel the second chapter with the twelfth chapter and then Revelation 1 8 those are layered
So what can we expect then? From those countries that are involved more with the East or then the Asia market, they can expect only one situation and one situation only. A reform of the privacy rights. Can be absolutely sure of it. Because when it comes of finances, the government must have its share instantly. There are financial institutions where the government can't take taxes from. Violates the privacy rights. And the only way they can monitor their 10% of earnings because of the area of investment, not because you are purchasing. There are a couple of situations. The first is then when you purchase. When you purchase a product, then if the government does its job, then obviously you are taxed. But then when you are investing, there is no way of tracking. It's a dual understanding at the same time via the same system where it is absolutely private or then, in other words, it is confidential. There you are, on the computer over there, you are selecting the products that you think would be the most purchasable in the future. For instance, third world countries, what would be the normal? Would it be having then more electrical wires, circuit breakers, plumbing? So you find then a product that is very important, nicely priced, where you think a lot of people would purchase this particular product. You go online, you enter the system, and then you select this particular product and you invest in it. you're not going to be investing in companies anymore. Companies, they always scandalize with your money. So then you basic situation then, you invest in the product and it gets recorded. So then your mindset of the midman must be erased. There is no more midman. You don't have to have a financial advisor anymore. Because the market is not going up and down anymore. That's why the countries are updating their backlogs so then when the system comes they are always in the positive. But then, there are financial institutions that are not tracked. In order for the government to maintain its tax level, those areas must be taxed. Otherwise, you have 12, 24 digits investments and the government does not get a cent out of it. And the only way a person can benefit from is when there is a transfer of funding. And obviously the user is going to transfer only the bare minimum. The rest of it is going to be invested. It's a system with a multiple options. You can pay people with it. You can purchase with it, you can invest with it. So when you read then in Galah 1.8, then the system, the Babylonian system making then freighters the most important. Why then the freighters are the most important? Because by the time then you invest and you receive, you are purchasing at the same time. That's what's going to make then the freighters extremely important and prominent. So then, with the situation in New Zealand, you begin to understand why then these leakages are then purposely 
done for the fact that they have to have some sort of privacy reform. Privacy Act reform. You can be sure of it. It's going to be the next step. Because there is no way of divulging the system yet. But how you design the subsystem must be such where then when the system comes then it's always in a positive. So what can you expect then from retailers? They're going to be out of work. In developed countries, they're going to be out of work because people can order online. You are not going anymore to go to the shop over there to get a pair of pants for 20 where you can get for 10 at no charge than for freight. That's why then it's going to have the freighters then the most prominent. And the system is going to be so involving. Some people they are going to be in the system 24-7. And the Messiah said, come out of the system, my people, because you have a duty to do. This is what the Messiah is saying. It's future yet. Then you begin to understand what it meant. The Chinese bought then the mortgage system of the mortgage bust of 08. Then you'll find Bank of China linking up with Citigroup. You'll find Bank of China linking up with HSBC. Because when the system comes, then they already have banking lined up for it. But then nations, they want to cling back to their junkies. How are they going to understand it? Worse yet, can they avoid then the panic that's coming in the future because the customs, they won't have any time to do the packages. The government, the first symptom later then when the system comes is what is this huge amount of packages? Then you have to say to yourself, duh, that may she already said a long time before, a system is coming and it's going to make the freighters very big and only freighting products from abroad is going to make the freighters prominent. And the government is not charging taxes enough. But rather than the president goes around he wants to get involved with five more monuments around the nation. Profound wisdom, isn't it? So then, expect many events coming because of privacy rights. Privacy rights reform. Would be the natural fact prior of the system. Otherwise, the government can maintain a record of what's coming out. And though people are going to be in the system, investing themselves, as long as they don't transfer, they can have 48 digits there. And the government doesn't know a thing. That's what's going to make the freighters very big.